black holes. They're the universe's ultimate monsters, cosmic vacuum cleaners where gravity is so intense that nothing can escape, not even light. Once something crosses the event horizon, that point of no return, it's game over. Einstein's theory of general relativity tells us that everything is crushed into an infinitely dense point called a singularity. For a long time, we thought that was the end of the story. What goes into a black hole, stays in a black hole. But then, in 1974, a brilliant young physicist named Stephen Hawking came along and threw a wrench in the works, creating one of the biggest puzzles in modern science, the black hole information paradox. Here's the problem. The two most important theories we have for describing the universe are on a collision course. On one side, we have general relativity. It says that once an object, say a book, falls into a black hole, all the information that made it a book, the words, the pages, the cover is completely wiped out. The black hole only remembers the book's mass, spin, and charge. The rest is gone forever. On the other side, we have quantum mechanics. A core rule of the quantum world is that information can never, ever be destroyed. It can be scrambled, hidden, or rearranged but it must always be preserved somewhere. You can burn the book, but in principle you could piece back all the information from the smoke and ash. So, one theory says information is destroyed, the other says it can't be. That's a major conflict. It gets even weirder with something called Hawking radiation. Hawking discovered that due to weird quantum effects at the edge of a black hole, they're not completely black, they slowly leak energy and shrink over mind-bogglingly long timescales, eventually evaporating into nothing. So, where does the information go? The radiation that leaks out seems to be completely random. It contains no trace of what fell in. It doesn't matter if it was a book, a planet, or your lost car keys, the radiation is the same. If the black hole disappears, and the information isn't in the radiation it leaves behind, then the information is truly lost. This would mean one of our fundamental theories of physics is wrong. This paradox has forced physicists to come up with some wild ideas. Maybe the information isn't inside the black hole, but is somehow smeared across its surface the event horizon, like a giant cosmic hologram. Or maybe black holes aren't singularities at all, but bizarre, fuzzy balls of vibrating strings. Solving this puzzle is key to finding a unified theory of everything that can finally connect the dots between the world of the very large and the world of the very small. Until then, the black hole information paradox remains one of the deepest mysteries in the cosmos, guarding the secrets to how our universe truly works. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe for more journeys into the unknown.